Number 1. The both of you connect on a mental level. Mental connection is very underrated when we are looking for a list of things that makes us go into a relationship. It helps your mental health in a relationship with someone that understands and can connect with you. That relationship would never stress you because your partner would understand you perfectly. They understand your mood and they understand everything you want without you even speaking up. This is very important in any relationship. It could save your relationship and save you from unnecessary stress. Connecting with your partner mentally means you understand them perfectly. They would always want to be around you even on their vulnerable state. You would also want to always be around them even in your vulnerable state. This is a very important and interesting dynamic in any relationship. When you are with someone that cannot cope with your kind of mentality, both of you will always have problems. You might not even understand what is always causing the issues. You just realize that both of you are close physically, but it seems you are very far apart. It could be that this is not who God has destined for you. Having mental connection is very different from having physical attraction for someone. When you are physically attracted to someone, you might just want to be seen with the person. And you are probably in the relationship for the hugs, kisses, cuddles, and sex. But when you are mentally attracted to someone, it is abstract as love should be. You just feel the connection, and you know they will always be there for you no matter what. Whenever you are around them, you feel safe and protected, not necessarily in a physical point of view. You feel you can talk to them about anything and everything without the fear of being judged or misunderstood. They give you the best advices because they can connect with you on a mental level. A relationship is not supposed to be just about the physical because it later gets boring and you get tired of it. It is the mental connection that will always be there to keep both of you moving. When you are with someone that you connect with on a mental level, then you can be sure that the relationship is definitely meant to be. Number 2. Both of you love each other. It is evident that a relationship can only work if both parties are in love with one another. A relationship built on love will forever flourish and will have all the marks of God's blessings all over it. Many people go into relationships without considering if they love the person or not. There are different reasons people go into a relationship. Some people go into a relationship because of looks. Some might go into the relationship for money. Some people even go into relationships for fame. All these reasons are things that can fade away. Once these things fade away, there may be nothing to hold the relationship together anymore. A relationship built on love is a perfect kind of relationship. These relationships are usually unexplainable. Both partners will be unable to point out a particular reason why they love each other. A love that has and can stand any trial. A love that cannot be broken by any external forces. It is no news that love is the most beautiful feeling that ever existed. When you want to see a relationship that God has blessed, the relationship would be beautiful inside out. Attaining optimal love for one's partner is God's will. Should that relationship exist as the will of God, then there is nothing stopping that relationship from flourishing. The mistake most people make is that they are not patient enough to let God lead them into making the right choice of partner. If we let God make this choice for us, unbreakable love would exist between us and our partner as we can be extremely sure that we did not make the wrong choice. When both of you are in love with each other, the relationship is definitely meant to be. Number 3. Both of you trust each other. Building trust can be very difficult. It cannot be rushed. Trust is a very strong foundation in which love is built. When there is trust, there is confidence that you and your partner can make it through any storm together. Lack of trust really makes relationships weak. When people are trying to break a relationship, they usually go for the test of trust. They usually plant a seed of doubt in the minds of the weakest link in the relationship. If this seed is allowed to grow, 
it starts to shake the foundation of the relationship. Only relationships that are blessed by God would stand this trial comfortably. People have different reasons why they would want to break someone else's relationship. Most times, it is due to jealousy. They probably cannot find the right partner for themselves and find it irritating that someone else is happy and comfortable in his or her relationship. They might also be in love with one of the person involved in that relationship and feel the person should be with them and not with their current partner. This also leads to jealousy and they just want to end relationship to see if they can have a chance with the person. Sometimes it might be that the person is in a silent competition with one of the parties in the relationship and probably his or her own relationship is not going so well and they feel the only way to get even is to destroy the other person's relationship. Any relationship that can sail through these trials, either by third party or self-destruction, because of lack of trust, that relationship is definitely blessed by God. Building trust is a long process. It takes only a moment to be broken. Fixing broken trust takes a longer time or sometimes it takes forever. A relationship that is blessed with trust between the two parties is indeed a relationship blessed by God. This means that both of you are really meant to be. Number 4. You are committed to the relationship. Being in a relationship simply means you accept your partner to be a very important part of your life. But being committed in a relationship means you have sworn an oath never to betray your partner. You are required to learn the act of self-control as there would exist numerous temptations to lure you away from the relationship. You must always remember that you have a commitment with someone. Almost every broken relationship is due to infidelity. Overcoming infidelity is a huge step in preserving your relationship. There are people who cannot stay committed in a relationship. Being in a relationship with these kinds of people can be frustrating. They are mostly emotional manipulators and would do anything to shift the blame on you. These people make relationship toxic for their partner as they would start looking elsewhere since they do not have any commitment to their partner. We fall into this kind of relationship mostly because we are not patient and did not feel it was important to wait on God to choose the right person for us. Having a partner who is committed to the relationship and does not cheat is a healthy relationship anyone would love to have. This kind of partner is definitely a blessing from God and should be accorded the same energy. Being committed to a relationship makes you focus on just you and your partner and you would constantly be looking for ways to push the relationship forward. Having this kind of relationship, it is safe to say your relationship is blessed by God. Number 5. You put God first in your relationship. Having a partner that constantly wants you to succeed and do great things in life is a blessing. Creating a positive environment for your growth as well as for his or hers, always reminding you to talk to God, adding little praise for you in your conversations, would not let you leave home without praying, would not let you sleep without praying, would not let you eat without thanking God for providing the food, a partner who understand that it is God first before any other thing or anybody. A partner who would never get in between your personal relationship between you and your God. Instead, he would improve the relationship. A partner that gets excited about taking you or following you to the place of worship. When you and your partner pray together, it shows you put God first in your relationship and you trust him to take complete control of the relationship. This impressive spiritual lifestyle has an overall effect on your life generally. It improves the physical aspect, psychological part, the emotional part as well as your spiritual life too. It helps grow love between you and your partner. We all love people who loves God. It also helps grow trust between you and your partner. We trust people that commit everything they do into God's hand. If you can have a perfect and committed relationship with God, then your partner can trust you to keep a committed relationship with him or her also. When you are in this kind of relationship that your partner is constantly trying to strengthen your relationship with God, 
then this is the perfect person that God has sent to you, and you can be sure that your relationship is blessed and both of you are meant to be.